I just need to know if the evil queen was here. Shh. Don't wake Robin. That rattle. She was here. Okay, fine. She was here. Well, you have to give that back. My mother's rattle. The only family heirloom I have. There are strings attached. But I'm a big girl. Well, stop judging me. I'm not trying to judge you. I'm trying to save you. Save me? You're the one that needed saving so badly. You ripped yourself in half. So if you're going to blame anyone here, blame yourself. It's still happening. I thought the cricket was helping you. I thought so too. Having a little trouble with your magic? Stay away from my mom. Henry. Now, is that any way to speak to your real mother? You're not my mother. Well, sure I am. I raised you. I helped you with your homework. I packed your lunches. Regina and I may have split, but I am as much your mother as she is. Now, stop slouching. Posture is self-respect, and if you don't have it, no one else will give it to you. Henry, hey, don't listen to her. Says the woman who was never around. You're right, I was never around, and I owned that. You're just the worst part of Regina. Am I? Or am I the part that is honest about myself? You see, Regina never had her happy ending because she's never been strong enough to let her story run its course. I won't make that mistake. Mm -mm. For myself. Or our new arrivals. What about those people? What do you want with them? Patience. You just wait until those untold stories play out. But here's a little spoiler. Cinderella's story won't end well. Why would you want to hurt Ashley? I don't. I want to hurt you. I want you to see how pointless you are. I saved her once, I'll save her again. Oh, that's the tragic thing about being the savior. You have to keep saving people. But once you're off the chessboard, everything falls apart. All those happy endings turn to dust, and your entire life means nothing. Let me show you what it feels like.